<laughs> well, stuck between the Hershey bars and the blow pops was this gold bangle with diamonds. So if you've been missing one since Halloween, take a look at this. Little Nessia Thomas was Dora the Explorer when she went trick-or-treating with her brother, cousins, and father. But who knew she would turn out to be a little detective? She was holding the bracelet, so I asked her, where did she get it? And she said, it's from the pumpkin. The two-year-old got a gold bracelet with diamonds along with her candy. And while chocolate is more her taste, Nessia's parents want to make sure someone gets this treat back. And when she was trick-or-treating, Somebody must have given the candy, and um, the bracelet must have stuck on the edge of the racket and fell inside. What were you thinking when you saw that in her basket? Uh, initially, I thought it's something fake, you know. Uh, it may not be the real one. But uh, uh, then, actually, when I hold it on, I thought it's a, it is a real one, and I was so surprised, you know. Like a lot of parents, they put Nessia's candy away for a few days so that she didn't eat it all. So it wasn't until a couple days ago when she dumped it all on the ground that she saw the bracelet was in there. So if anybody thinks that it's their bracelet, please, uh, we'll give you that phone number. It's 249-1370. Uh, That's 248-249-1370. Give a call and let them know. We purposely blurred it so that when you call, you can describe it and claim it as yours. Live in Northville Township, I'm Glenda Lewis. Back to you. All right. Thank you so much, Glenda.